Rolling stock for the big four. That's LNER, LMS, GWR, SR. This is a series of three tutorials that will show you how to make each of these vans and wagons. We're going to start today with the goods van. To make the goods van, you will need 15 grey terracotta, four pistons, four levers, 14 dark oak fences, 16 spruce stairs, 16 nether brick stairs, eight hoppers, 39 spruce slabs, 112 spruce trap doors, 55 stone slabs, three nether brick slabs. Banners are optional. I've got 2S and 1R because I'm doing Southern Railway rolling stock and of course waste blocks. Let's get started. We'll begin as we did with the engine. So waste block on one of your tracks and now we put grey terracotta on top. Remove the waste block and this is one, two, three. So you end up with a row of three grey terracotta straddling the rails but one block up. Come around to the back of the grey terracotta and from the middle one we're going to put nine grey terracotta. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And now at the end, one, two, three. Okay, we're going to make buffers. Either side of your rows of three grey terracotta, a piston. And now levers on the outer grey terracotta. So flick them down and you've got buffers. I got this directly from Crafty Fox. I'll put a link in the description to his channel. He's well worth watching. Go up the other end, do exactly the same thing. Right, we need couplings, nether brick slabs. Bottom half slab coming off the middle grey terracotta. Same at this end too. You can put one, you can put two, it depends how many you're linking, what other wagons you've got, what couplings they have. Let's make wheels, starting at either end. Leave this first grey terracotta blank and on the second one, a right way up nether brick stair. Underneath that, an upside down nether brick stair and on the other side, upside down right way up. One wheel. Go to the other end and do the same thing. If you've done that right, you will have three blocks in between. Do that on the other side. And there we go. Now on each wheel, you're gonna put two hoppers with the funnels facing into the stairs. And at the ends here, between the buffer and the wheel, two dark oak fence. And between the hoppers, we're gonna put dark oak fence. You have to shift click for the first one, and then two, three. There's our undercarriage. Now for the bed of the wagon. Starting at the piston. Spruce stairs. One, two, three, four. Do the same at the other end. Start at the piston. One, two, three, four. And same on the other side. Now fill in the whole of the bed with spruce slabs, bottom half, which means you won't need any lighting in this. It's already spawn proof. And over the top of the dark oak stairs, one, two, three, four, five, six. Now we're going to build up the walls with spruce trap doors. So come to the inside and one, two, three, four. Uh, shift and you can jump to put the next one on. And then a third row. And if you fold those up, you'll get a wall. Do that on each of the groups of stairs. There we go. Now to make the van doors, you can make them closed or open. It's entirely up to you. I'll show you how to do both. So we'll come to this side and we'll do a closed one. 
on the bottom of these slabs one two three and then still facing into the van we're going to jump up and do a row do another row and one more fold them all up and you have a closed door and if you can see it sits slightly out of line with the walls now for an open door these doors slide well they don't in Minecraft they do in real life so I'm going to have this open two blocks so I'm coming to the third of these slabs one two three and now we build this up the same way that we built up the closed door there we are one sliding door partly open now we've got to make the end walls so come on to the buffers or the couplings and we're going to put one two three four five trap doors don't worry that these stand up it's because of the levers just fold them down manually and now build up a wall that is four trapdoors height including this row once that's done repeat the process at the other end all that's left now is the roof so stone slabs place it on top of one of the walls and now fill in the entire roof with your stone slabs it won't come quite to the end there's not a lot we can do about that and there it is finished you can leave it like this this is perfectly acceptable or you can label it now I've got S and R for Southern Railways if you're going to put banners on it I will come around to the other side first so come across one two three from the end and then one down and you'll have to shift to place the banner do the same at the other end one two three one down shift to place the banner SR if we come around to this side where the door is open we're only going to have room for one banner because the door has slid open and is covering where the letter would be so one two three one down and shift to place the banner and that's it now our little goods van really is finished